I was messaging um, earlier with a friend of mine on Facebook and he just happened to say, oh, Chromatogastro will be flying here soon. And uh, I said, oh yeah, they don't fly here till August like they did last year. And I took a few steps and lo and behold, here's the one of two Chromatogastro queens I found tonight. Um, so, I just want to make a quick video to show you how I move a queen into a growth chamber. These are going to be going into a small, medium sized growth chamber. You can see I've already filled, it, filled up the water reservoir in there. And I'm just going to put them directly into this portion. One thing you want to do is always plug your holes up. That's easy to forget, believe it or not. And I'm not sure if these are made or not. Um, chances are good that they are. Just because when I found them, they're rubbing their wings together. Um, looked like they were going to break them off. The lights were going to shut off. I did not have time to watch them. So I'm just going to drop her right into this chamber and put the top on. See, and that happens sometimes. Sometimes you got to kind of encourage them to stay in there. And once they're in there, you want to put them in the dark immediately because that, that way they'll settle down quickly. So I'm going to put her under a towel. Actually, I have a Fidoli queen in here as well. None of these gals seem to really mind each other. I just know that from experience. This time of year you can almost throw any of the queens together and they don't really seem to be bothered by the other ones. Not the case when you're in the Campanotas flight season at all. Where they will just gas. Same with Formica. They'll gas each other to death. Okay, and there's the second one. y'all a much better look at this queen here and then she's alive and she looks okay when she starts moving maybe she's just a little surprised and there she goes picks her head up a little bit we'll see how they do uh, I'll definitely keep updates on these I love the species um, this would be uh, big for me, you know, just out of having fun with my ant keeping collection, just to get her or one of these two or both of them going with colonies. Be exciting. 